Let's bring in the DA's caucus leader, Leah Knott, in the caucus leader in Johannesburg. Uh, thank you so much for making time, uh, Leah Knott. What a sad, sad afternoon. Uh, the office of the mayor of Johannesburg confirming around midday uh, that the mayor has passed away due to COVID-19 complications. Condolences, you worked with him closely. How did you receive the news and how are you reflecting on his life? Yeah, look, it, it came as, as quite a shock. I think this pandemic is affecting the lives of, of every South African at this moment and it's, it's not picking sides. Um, you know, he was a relatively healthy individual. He was very robust in, in council. Um, and, and in essence, you know, it was very unfortunate to hear of his passing this morning. Um, the, the ANC caucus in Johannesburg did let us know. And, uh, you know, we, we expressed and, and we do express our sincerest condolences to his friends, family and colleagues. It's very difficult to lose somebody that you work with. Um, and and councillors will know, you know, we work with these people. They're, they're like our family. Mm. Um, we spend an enormous amount of time together. So it's, it's a huge loss. And, and I, I really pray for strength and comfort to them during this difficult time. Yeah. And as you say, I mean, these people become family. And you may disagree uh, on a lot of things, on policy positions, on different approaches. Uh, but as you indicate, you work with these people and you spend a lot of time with them and they become family. When last did you interact with the mayor? Um, we know that he went into hospital a couple of days ago, but also now living in the times of COVID and in the thick of the third wave, I know that a lot of things were happening virtually. When was the last interaction? Sure, I, I think about two weeks ago. It was just before he, he went on, on leave. Um, we did in, in, engage, um, you know, and, and we did engage as councillors quite often, you know, um, out of the, the public eye uh, because things need to be done and as councils that's our mandate. So we did have discussions um, on a quite a continuous basis and uh, you know it's, it's, that's why I said it's, it's completely shocking. I don't think it's actually hit me or a lot of people just yet that, that this has happened. I think it's going to take quite a few days to, to sink in and as you said you know we do we, do, we differ on political grounds on, on policy grounds and, and there are times where we need to um, go up against each other, but at the end of the day, we're all human beings, and and all we can wish for each other is health and, and happiness. And um, so we're very sad that this has happened. I, I think it's you know, it's really not anything I would wish on on any other person. Yeah, Leah, not thank yeah. you so much for making time and condolences uh, once again as colleagues of of the late mayor of Johannesburg. She is the leader of the DA caucus in Johannesburg. Let's bring.